Hello, hello, it's Zoe here and today we are talking all about the inner thighs. This is a common area that a lot of women reach out to me about looking for help and support. The inner thighs is just one of those spots that a lot of us women tend to store a little bit of fat, which is not a bad thing, it's part of our genetics. So um, there's a couple tips that I'd like to give you today. I'm gonna show you a couple exercises and we're also gonna really address how we can target this area and the interesting thing about this area is it's a lot like everywhere else on the body we need a combination of a few things to really start seeing those results so hello as you are coming on make sure you say hi let me know what you're up to today and if there's ever a specific body part that you're interested in learning how to target make sure you let me know and as we're going along here I have placed a special link around this video for you or at the link in my bio so that you can check out my 15 minute total body sculpting routine that really hits all of those major areas that us women are looking to get after, okay? So first, hello, hello. Today we are talking about the inner thighs. So as I said, the inner thighs are a spot that we can store a little bit of fat. Not a bad thing. Now, we can do exercises to help build some muscle and get stronger in that area and help tighten up. But if there's still that layer of fat over top, then it's gonna be hard to see noticeable results. And that's why I absolutely love mixing in high intensity interval training towards the end of your workouts, like I do in that 15 minute routine I was talking about, just three or four minutes at the end of your workout to really help um, amp up the calorie burn, help us to torch fat without putting a lot of pain and strain on the body. So some great examples of these are mountain climbers. And the thing to remember is with high intensity, it's all about your fitness level and pushing yourself to work really hard. So you could just as easily do a squat and go really slow, just like a body weight squat. But if you were gonna do HIT, you would move nice and quick for a minute, really working to get the heart rate up and to help us get into that fat burning zone, help us to create the afterburn effect. So mountain climbers, the ones where we're in a plank position, alternating drawing the knees in, the squats, um, We'll even do like a step back lunge nice and quick to help make sure that we are really getting into, into that fat burning zone. So HIT is my first tip for you. If you don't know how to do that, make sure you tap the link and I can walk you through how we do that on the next page. So HIT workouts, really great for helping to target burning fat in general, but especially where we store fat at the inner thighs. The next move that I'm gonna show you, the first one we don't use this band, but the next move I show you, we're gonna use this band. So for now, all you're gonna do, let me tilt this down just a smidge and move back onto my mat, is a goddess squat. So what you do is step the feet nice and wide apart and then have the feet from about 30 to a 45 degree turnout. So it's just a slight turnout. Your knees bend and track in line with the middle toe and then you rise up squeezing through the inner thighs. So coming down, coming up, a goddess squat. This is what it looks like from the side. Coming down, coming up. Now this also works the glutes. Not a bad thing, <laughs> helps us to work the bum too, but that point where we get really low and feel the stretch, try and focus on squeezing from the inner thighs to rise back up, and that'll help target those inner thighs. And let me show you one more. This one is so cool, and it uses the total body sculpting band as well, which I absolutely love, um, for really targeting those those hard to reach muscles. So what you're gonna do is lay on your side. Let's see if I can fit my body in here. Okay, so you're gonna lay on your side and place the band over one foot, put that foot on the floor. Slide the other leg through the band like so and come down onto your forearm. Okay, can you see me? Now all you're doing is lifting the leg up, using the inner thigh and stretching the band apart like so. Oh, I can feel it right here, 
right in that inner thigh. Helps to flex the foot and drive through the heel. I know it's a bit hard to see with those comments. So you can always swipe the comments over to one side. But that is a great way to amp up um, a pretty kind of common exercise, but take it that much further and make it way, way more effective. And that is what we are all about here at Yoga Burn, is making the most of your time, making sure that the moves you're doing are effective. You don't have to spend an hour a day getting your workout done. We can help you get that done in 15 minutes. So I wanted to share those with you. So of course, we've got our exercises, our beautiful goddess squat, and our inner thigh leg lift with the total body sculpting band, and then the hit workouts. And like the mountain climber one I was talking about is just the one like this. And you can even do it kind of quick, right? That's to get the heart rate up. Or we'll sometimes do a step up and lift for another hit one. And again, the combination of doing the right exercises for the right amount of time with that little bit of resistance mixed in with the HIIT training at the end is where we find so many women are getting great results. So make sure you head on over to the link um, that I've placed for you in the next page so I can walk you through my absolutely favorite 15 minute total body sculpting routine that targets all of those areas that us ladies are getting to. I saw some of you um, saying about the triceps and I've got lots of great moves for you on the next page as well. So please do hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. It lets me know what you like to see and feel free to share this video to help um, your friends and followers as well. I hope you have an absolutely amazing day and I will see you on that next page. Namaste.